Members of the Nigerian Association of Resident Doctors, NARD, have commenced an industrial action across the country. The strike, which was scheduled to begin on Thursday, followed an ultimatum issued to the federal government, which expired on Wednesday. Our correspondent, Jacinta Abuku, was at the Lagos State University Teaching Hospital and now reports. The demands of the Nigerian Association of Resident Doctors as contained in a communique includes but not limited to the doctor's immediate payment of all salaries owned to all house officers, including match salaries, salary shortfalls of 2014, 2015, and 2016 of members in all federal institutions, including state-owned institutions, as earlier agreed with the government. Plus TV Africa stopped by at the Lagos University Teaching Hospital, Luth, to find out how the strike is going on. Some of these issues are not new things to the Nigerian people. So uh, we just feel that it's, it's insensitive of the government that that's why that NAD has, you know, um, been agitating on some of this issue. Government has not seen it uh, necessary to come to a round table to discuss and find solution to some of these uh, challenges facing residency training in Nigeria. And that is why we feel that, you know, uh, having, you know, endured for so long, uh, you know, there's no better time than now to say this is not acceptable. Enough is enough. One wonders if there are no other means to register the doctor's demand rather than the strike, considering the patients. Strike is usually the last result in any struggle. And uh, you, can, you can judge from the time it has taken for this strike to be, you know, to be implemented eventually. What then happens to the patients, considering it's an indefinite strike? No doctor, you know, uh, wants to abandon his, his, his or her pa uh, patients. That's the truth. You know, the passion we have for this work and uh, the way we take our patients, we don't, we, we don't normally want to go on strike, except when it is absolutely necessary. And that is why you see that it usually takes a long process before strike will eventually be resorted to. And, uh, you know, it's something that is unfortunate that it's, 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 it has to, you know, happen sometime. Ahead of the strike, the Minister of Labor and Employment, Chris Ngige, held a conciliatory meeting with the leaders of the union on Wednesday in Abuja. At the meeting, he appealed to the aggrieved medical practitioners to have a rethink, saying the federal government was making efforts to ensure their demands are met. Jacinta Obuku reporting for Plus TV Africa. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.